Welcome to luxury land, guys. Wow. What is this? Heaven. <laughs> People all want luxury, but they don't want to pay the luxurious price tag. I want the quality of a yacht life for the price of a pontoon. We got you. My name is Michelle, and I've designed some of the most expensive homes in the country. Woo! But my small town boots have taught me one simple truth. Everyone deserves luxury. Are you kidding? It's amazing. This is overwhelming. So my team and I have figured out how to get that luxury for less. That we can repurpose stuff and recover it. We're painting a lot of rooms. You can get this tent paint for like 25 cents a gallon. Really? Luxury just takes you over. This was a scratch and dent. All we had to do was change that one panel. You got your ring? I want the money where we touch. This looks really expensive. What does that mean? We don't have a lot of money. Do you want to taste of the good life, but not break the bank? No pressure. Oh, my God. I need a hug. <laughs> So we're meeting Marsha and Jeff. Okay. And they got the cutest dog. What's the dog's name? Baxter. <laughs> and that must be Baxter. <laughs> That's Baxter. <laughs> hi. Hey, how's it going? Don't shoot, don't shoot, Hello. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm Kai. I'm Marsha. Nice, nice to meet I'm you. I'm Jeff. We've been married for 17 years. Yes, long time. <laughs> when I think luxury, I want there to be a wow factor when people come into our house. And when I come into my own house, I want there to be a wow factor. I look at the magazines and I think, I want that. We have $100,000 to spread out through the main floor. Oh, oh my gosh, look at him. Isn't that adorable? <laughs> it's so yellow. Yeah, it's, it's a lot. It's on the ceiling. Also, these stair runners have seen better days. You're right. They're expensive to replace, but you guys definitely need an upgrade. Right. It's, okay. it's time for a change. Oh, and Kai, look at that chandelier. Someone sent it back to Game of Thrones. <laughs> Basically. Yeah. But it does evoke a good mood, I gotta yeah. tell you. Yeah, yeah. It continues to be yellow. It's literally everywhere. everywhere. Mm -hmm. And we should reorient the Agreed. furniture, right, Kai? Because when you walk in, this is like a barrier. There's no television, so why not face the couch towards the kitchen where all the interaction is happening mm -hmm. anyway? Yes. Did you paint that fireplace? I did. So it's the red brick from the front of the house. Uh, how do you feel about the mantle? Is it's, it a keeper? Uh, no, it's dated. It feels old fashioned. Right. I would love either a natural wood beam sure. or something. Okay. We've been here eight years, and so we haven't touched anything. How long did you live here before you realized you wanted to renovate? Maybe four years ago, yeah. we started talking about, like, about it. We had smaller kids. We thought if we fix things up, they just yeah. trash it. Trust me, I get it. I actually see that a lot with clients that have young kids. How old are your kids? <laughs> uh, they're 11 and 14. Okay. I know it's not okay for you guys to say this, but the kids are older. It's time for you to be selfish a little bit. Let's indulge. Let's get what you want. When we first moved in, I loved the kitchen. It was certainly an upgrade from our townhouse that we lived in before we moved in here. I didn't mind the dark countertops. And then living in them, it's like, oh, I can see all the crumbs. And oh, I can see all this. Yes. How do you feel about the backsplash? Well, I mean, if we lived in New Mexico <laughs> or <laughs> Arizona. <laughs> Some things I'd like to replace in the house are certainly the paint color, update the countertops and the cabinets. An island is a must have. I want to have a giant island. As far as material goes, I love the look of marble. I'm just not so sure if we can afford I it. I want the quality of a yacht life yeah. for the price of a pontoon. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately, we want to get rid of this wall. And Marsha, I know that's really important to you, and you want yeah. it all gone, right? If possible. It's likely something in there, yeah. and we're probably going to have to integrate it into the island. We should take the island this way. I want okay. all of this open, if that's okay yeah. with you. Yeah, Make sure. the island a lot wider, right? Minimum four feet deep. Minimum. That way, you've got prep surface and sink on this side. That's all you, right? And then on the other side, Jeff and the kids could be eating, or Jeff, maybe you're washing dishes. Who knows? We never yeah. know. You know? Be a <laughs> There's always a first. <laughs> <laughs> so, Michelle, what are some ideas you had for this island? You know I want a waterfall, guy. A waterfall in the kitchen? Is yeah. that really luxury nowadays? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> wow. You know okay. what that means, right? Yeah, I have the uh, countertop. Oh, okay. Turns 90 degree angle and goes down to the floor. Oh, okay. That's a waterfall. waterfall oh, I thought it was an actual waterfall. Wow, I didn't know that, that was luxury. That would be luxury. <laughs>